Have you ever watched snow falling from the sky? Tiny white flakes drifting down, covering everything in sparkling white? Snow looks magical, but it forms through a real science process. So, how does snow form? Let's explore the wintry secret. All snow begins high up in the clouds. Clouds are made of teeny tiny drops of water floating in the air. When the air gets cold enough, those drops begin to change. When the temperature in the cloud is below freezing, the water droplets freeze into tiny ice crystals. These crystals are the very beginning of snowflakes. Inside the cloud, crystals bump into each other and stick together. As more and more crystals join, they grow bigger and more detailed, forming the beautiful tiny shapes we call snowflakes. No two snowflakes look exactly the same. That's because each snowflake takes a different path through the cloud passing through different temperatures and humidity levels. This changes how the ice grows, creating amazing, unique patterns. When snowflakes get heavy enough, gravity pulls them down. They drift slowly through the air because they are tiny and light. That's why snowflakes fall gently instead of fast like rain. But snow doesn't always reach the ground. If the air below the cloud is warm, the snowflakes melt and turn into rain. For snow to fall, the air from the cloud to the ground must stay cold. If clouds keep creating snowflakes for hours, and if the temperature stays cold, the flakes pile up on the ground. That's how we get deep, fluffy snow, perfect for snowman and snowball fights. So, how does snow form? Cold clouds turn water drops into ice crystals. The crystals stick together to make snowflakes. And if the air stays freezing, the snowflakes reach the ground. Snow may look magical, but it's really frozen science falling from the sky. Stay curious, kids. Even winter has wonderful secrets. Thanks for learning with Curiously Kids. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more magical lessons. Bye-bye.